I can't believe that the plan we had didn't work. Connor, I still have a huge plan that can roil him up. It's something I've been planning to do for a long time. Hopefully this one works. Let's steal a million from Waldwick's safe. Wait, what? That way, no one, even Dylan, will win the game. Everyone will lose. We never agreed to this. I thought you were going to help me stop Dylan. Oh, I'm still helping you. Oh wow, helping me steal something and get arrested. You better do this. If you don't do it, then you'll see what's coming for you. No. I'm not taking that risk. It's not fair to the other players for me to steal the money. Oh, you're gonna pay for this. Hey, put me down now. You didn't agree to my orders, so you're getting what you deserve. I'm gonna go steal that million, and I'm gonna be Jeff Bezos rich. Wait, your voice changed? You. I'm finally going to show you who I truly am. No. It can't be. Oh, you know who I am. Well, at least I got my mask back on. Don't want the cops to catch me. Now, I'll go steal that million. Okay, time to take my allergy pills. Connor, are you okay? Ugh. What happened? You look like you're recovering from a panic attack. You good? I'm fine. FIX went out on his own, and is possibly going to go steal the million dollars from us. Um, this isn't a trick, right? Believe me. He betrayed me. So all of this is actually true? Yes. I'm telling the truth. Though I'm still a little untrustworthy of Connor, I still think he's telling the truth this time around. I mean, he could possibly be right. Hi. Can I have some time alone? Anything wrong, my little sprite? Yes. And that thing wrong is you. Um. Sir? Why am I the problem? I had a perfect invention that didn't work out the way I wanted. Your team had the audacity to summon you and turn on the lights. I'm jealous because you have magical powers, while I don't, and I'm supposed to be the one who solves all the problems here. Look. I'm not trying to take that role from you. I'm only four days old, and yet I still can't figure out where I am as well, or how certain things work. So I'm not ruining your life. That's all you good characters do. Brag about your success, and stopping villains. Sir, I'm trying to help you out as well. I'm trying to help everyone in this cast. You say that, and you only help out the nice people. Service for this? Tea? Have a sip. You seem to be a bit tense. I have it to calm my nerves. If you say so. Wow. This tea actually is really good. So what's your opinion on nice characters now? Maybe there's some that are annoying, but I guess there are some who can help you as well, even if you did bad things. That's what I'm trying to say. That's why you take a deep breath and see what a person is truly like. I'm sorry for thinking you were only helping out nice people. I never knew you cared about other people as well. It's totally fine Sprite. You're just mad about something that didn't go as planned. I get it. First Akumi, now the fairy. Wow, I never knew some nice people cared about the meanness. Should Chloe know about this? Oh no, that would be embarrassing. What if I'm not her friend anymore? You were 10 minutes late. What was the hold up?
Nothing. I was working on another invention. Welcome back Octave Octopuses, it's nice to see you back. Once again, you'll be losing another person. You'll be down to five members after this elimination. So let's get started. Kimberly, you had immunity the last time around, so you're safe. Thank you. I'm so happy I'm safe. Takumi, you also avoid another elimination. No one voted for you this time around, you're safe as well. I'm happy that I'm still in it to win it. At least no one targeted me this time around. Plus, I finally got the immunity card. I've been waiting for a long time, but I finally got it. Gregory, you also avoid the bottom two. Three people only wanted you gone. You're safe again. Thank goodness. At least a lot of people saved me this time around. Chloe, you're safe as well. Five people only wanted you gone. You avoid the bottom two. Well, at least no one wanted me out this moment. I'm happy some people spared me. Klitz, and Elec Man. You are in the bottom two. One of you will be sent home for good, while the other will be safe from this elimination. It was a tight vote in the end. One of you got 24, while the other got 26. The ninth player, eliminated from season 9, is going to be. Elec Man. I'm sorry, dude, but you have been sent home. Klitz, you survived the bottom two for the third time in a row. This is why you betrayed me, Klitz. You wanted me sent home for good. Thanks for partnering up with Takumi. Well, you should have took my advice. Helping out the team is urgent, and I can't deal with your complaining anymore. I don't want to see your stupid face again. Dude. He should relax. I'm not targeting him outside of the game. It's a competition. Just roll with it. Well at least I don't have to worry about Elect Man anymore. Hopefully he realizes that I'm actually useful for challenges. Why is Klitz acting weird around me? He hasn't been talking to me that much, and he's starting to act nicer. Okay, contestants. We have a huge problem going on. We have been notified that there is a criminal on campus. For the next challenge, we need to catch the criminal. We have two officers that are helping us for this challenge. Officer Freya, and Officer Whitney. I'll take the group with the tech genius. I think he's helpful for this challenge. Oh well. I'm still stuck with a good group anyway. I will count this as the final challenge before the merge. So whoever gets him back here first, wins for their team, and they advance to the merge. So, let's get things started in here. We could possibly stop the guy who Connor is working with. I mean, he's been going after Dylan for months. A criminal? Well, there was one here this entire time. How did I not know that? Okay, people. Do you guys have any ideas to stop the person who's stealing the million dollars? You know, I think I can hack the system, so that the alarm can go off easily. I've done it before, at my house, when I wanted to turn off the smoke alarm. I just need to find a way to make it turn on. If that's the closest that we can get, I guess we can do that. I just want to catch him already. Yeah, you're the person who would do well with this clits. I mean, I saw your skills back in the first challenge, and I think you can succeed at this. Let's give it a shot. Hopefully it works. Hold up, where's Kimberly? Guys guys guys, I found it. You found the criminal already? We just started to find a way to stop him. I found this diamond on the floor. I can finally spend it on a new house. That's not a real diamond. That's the walled diamond. Gosh, how high is your IQ number? Well, 
probably not that high, because you're being annoying again. Gregory, I thought you were friends with her. Were. Look Kimberly, at first I thought you were nice, but your optimism isn't helpful for me and the team. If you just worried about the game, rather than your stupid friendship thing, then you would be likable a lot more. Good. Walk away. I don't want to see your stupid face until you get eliminated. What the heck happened to Gregory? He was nice in the beginning, and now he's starting to become a lot more rowdy. I can't believe he hurted Kimberly's feelings. She deserved that. All she has done was being a stupid idiot. If she would have been in the game for a shorter amount of time, then I'll be happy to see her go last episode. But obviously, she had to get immunity. Look, I know you might believe that I may be lying about this, but I know where this guy is. Is this all true? Or, are you lying? Believe me. I'm telling the truth. After we catch this guy, I'm changing my attitude. I won't play these stupid tricks I fooled you guys on anymore. Alrighty. If you know where he is, then I guess we'll follow your lead. Okay, FIX is known for stealing multiple things. When I was in the cabin, I saw who he was, and I knew he was a big criminal back in an old season. Well, the only person who I thought it was, was Ernesto. I don't have a big vision on his face, but I know he looked around our aged, or maybe he was an older man. I don't remember his name though, since he took it off quickly, and put it back on when I was passed out from panicking. So, how are we going to stop him? Penny? Do you know anything about stopping criminals? You faced one before. I know a few things, but maybe luring him with something, or trapping him in a cage would work? Not gonna lie, I should have not asked you that question. Let's just try to block him, so that way we can stop him easily. If Connor knows what to do in this situation, I guess I should trust him. Though I'm still upset about what he did to me. If Connor's plan works out, I guess I'll have faith in him again. Maybe after this, he'll apologize about what he did. Perfect. Here's the million dollars that Warwick has. As long as I escape, I'll be able to use this to get away with any acts I committed before. Heh <laughs> Oh man, I'm a genius. Attention people! We have a warning going on. Someone has stole the million. Everyone needs to stop him. Now. Oh no! I got to get out of here. How's it going? Not wonderful. Look, I don't think Gregory was the best person to be friends with. But I'm friends with literally everyone on the team. You think that? But, sometimes, they don't want you around. Remember a few weeks ago, you said something like this as well? I did. But it was supposed to tell you how I wanted to try to get you and Clit's clothes. Well, though you may have friends, you might have enemies as well. It's okay to have hatred for someone. You're just too afraid to show it. Does that mean I have to hate you? No. We're friends, and maybe some other people are as well. But sometimes there are some people who don't like you. I have beef with a leg man. So maybe sometime in the future, maybe you can notice who's going after you. But what if they're being nice to me, just to fake it and right to send me home? Trust your sources, and notice it a little. Thanks for the advice. I can still be like this though. Correct? It does not change your personality. You're still Kimberly. Stop what you're doing. I have the million, and if you just let me by, I'll be able to escape. Okay, I'm scared. I've learned some stuff from Ramsey Route 17. You wanna fight me, dude? Fight me. Fight me. Oh yeah. Do you think you can throw a punch? He never taught me this. Well, can you let me by now? You're not going anywhere. Oh wow, thanks for showing up again. Nice to see you haven't got a tired of me, Connor. Penny, try to block him like I am. You're not going anywhere, FIX, 
Oh no! This can't be happening. Unfortunately. You have nowhere else to run. You have finally been caught by the police. Before we turn you in, we will be taking off that mask. Thanks a lot FIX, for making my game terrible. We're finally getting the answers we need. Plus, we're getting security wide field. We're gonna make sure you're not escaping anytime soon. Finally! We caught him! He has nowhere else to run now! He's getting what he deserves! Okay. Let's see who is behind this mask. Renshi. All this time, I was working with a criminal. Why did you show up in the first place? I told you not to come back. You eliminated me unfairly. I wanted to come back to ruin other players' shot at the million. Because what I wanted was to get revenge from what you did in the past. I wouldn't let you come back anyway, even with the disguise. A true person shouldn't be manipulated others to do stealing or drugs. The person in those situations has to make their own decision. Please Wally. Can I compete in season 10? With that behavior, I'm not letting you. This isn't the last of me Wally. I will find you and ruin your show again. Thanks for stopping the criminal everyone. Unfortunately, the Octave Octopuses will face elimination again. One last time, Squishy Squids. You're all making the merge this season. Waldwick, don't let them face elimination. I have an announcement to make. Okay, Connor, what's up? Why don't you want me to not put them up for elimination? <sighs> I'm quitting the game. You want to quit the game? Why do you want to do that? Well, I deserve to face the same punishment as Wrenchy. I worked with him, and I'm ashamed for doing that. If I quit, I'll learn from my mistakes and see if I can improve as a person. We respect your choice, Connor. You can leave the show. Octave Octopuses, you will not face elimination this time around. You will all be in the merge. Dylan, I apologize to you the most. I'm sorry for making you nervous around your peers. It was FIX's manipulation schemes, and I shouldn't have done it. Connor, your apology has been accepted. Don't do anything like this again. I know I don't apologize to people usually the first time around, but this time, I truly mean it. Malachite and Grapey, I also apologize for antagonizing you. We forgive you Dylan. Hopefully the rest of the game goes really well. I'll see you later people. Thanks for forgiving me. So what's gonna happen now? A simple thing actually. Kimberly, you have the wall diamond, correct? Yay. I have it. Do I use it for something? Yup. You will be deciding a person, from our wildcard, to join the game. You have 30 options to choose from, and whoever you selected, joins this season. Viewers, please do not vote this time around. You can just sit back and watch. Here's the 30 options Kimberly can choose from. My buddy Dante got robbed in season 8. Come on Kimberly, please pick me to compete. Having a chance at the million would be nice. Though I have other chances, I guess you can vote for me Kimberly. Just select me already Kimberly. I'm nothing like Gregory. Hopefully you can have me on the show. I really want to make my mom proud. I don't mind joining, I'll be happy to run in this anyway. Please vote for me Kimberly, so that I do not make you worry. Ha <laughs> ha, get it? If you select me, I'll be happy. Just don't send me home too early. Come on Kimberly. I hope you select the Blue Moon Cowboy. Yeehaw. I hate everyone in this game. But I guess I'll ask you to vote for me. You don't seem that bad. Oh yeah. This music rocks. One of the best things I ever heard. Come on Kimmy. Select me for this show. I really want to meet you. Come on Kimberly. Vote for the shy girl who didn't get her chance to shine in the second season of CAC. I'm good with my job, and I'm good with athletic challenges. Please give me a shot at the million. You know me well, Kimberly. Select me for the show this time around. I like milk. 
Why oh why 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 Let me join the game so that I can destroy that in season 10. I'm going to win that season for sure. Though we're on the same hero team, I don't mind if you select someone else, Kimberly. It's your opinion, not mine. Um, why am I here in the first place? I'm not a Rousey Route 17 ripoff. I'm a true player for sure. Hey Kimberly, do you want to go out on a date with me? If so, please select me. Um, hopefully these people are nice. Hopefully you can give me a chance, Kimberly. I would really enjoy competing alongside you. I really want to win for Coiny. Hopefully you select me, since I'm really athletic and strong. I hope you all get ready, since I'm ready to play and destroy everyone with my soda cans. I guess I'll give something like this a go. I mean, competing is something I want to try. I'm not a ripoff of Cecilia Yang, I'm just a sweet girl who wants to compete so badly. Come on Kimberly, give me a shot. Por favor Kimberly, yo tengo que ganar. Hopefully you select me, since I don't want to hang around a bunch of Mary Sue's anymore. Minus the ones who weren't. If there's a person you need that knows a few things about gaming, then you're in luck, since I'm competing this season. Give me a shot Kimberly. I better not see anyone like those stupid nice characters who think they're better than us. If I do, then I'll be triggered beyond belief. And those are all of the players that Kimberly can select from. Viewers, do not vote this time around. Let Kimberly make her mind with this choice. However, you can still comment about the episode, since I want you guys to have a break from voting. Thank you all for watching this episode, and we will see you in episode 10. This is Waldwick, signing off.